Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. Every now and again, you take the bait. Somebody hits you with a price for a firearm that is worth the bait. And sometimes it's not always exactly what you want, but you figure, you know, for that price, I really can't get hurt too bad. So that's my case today. I will explain more as we get through the video, but let me go ahead and show you what I got. It's made by Palmetto State Armory, and this is the 5.7 Rock. When they came out with this, it surprised a lot of people. They weren't expecting it, but here it is. It's the 5.7 Rock that is an interesting 5.7 by 28 millimeter handgun. It's a full-size handgun. This one has the threaded barrel and the barrel is fluted, which is very nice. You could buy the complete lower, the complete upper, put it together. You could buy it in a full package. You can buy it with or without the threaded barrel. They have different barrel coatings and all that. It's, it's super flexible what PSA did with this. And 23 round magazines and it does come with two of them but i picked this up used and it, it's really not used it's like brand new in flat dark earth many different colors many different options the one thing that i wanted that i originally was going to back out of the deal was optics ready now if you look at their site everything that is available is optics ready but initially some of them weren't, and I think that's when this one was purchased, or the previous owner purchased the upper and the lower separately, because the box that I showed you was actually a box from the dagger. It was not from this 5.7 rock. Anyhow, here we have a 5.2 inch threaded barrel that is fluted, nice look to it, all in flat dark earth. It has the full size grip, a bit wider, check out the width of that magazine. All right, it's pretty wide for the longer 5.7 round. Decent grip texturing, little light grit sandpaper, little bump right there, which I think is cool. Not a big deal, no finger grooves or anything like that. It does have the trigger there with a safety tab. All right, and we'll see that. Now, I am measuring this at six pounds even with a reset that is pretty short. Check that out. It's got a three-slot Picatinny rail, forward serrations, and three-dot night sights. Now, these are budget-priced. When you look at how much PSA is asking for this and some of the others out there, you will see that this is very much a budget-priced, full-size, 5.7 by 28 millimeter handgun with 23-round magazines. You can pick this up for 400 bucks, a little bit less. And then some of the higher end models, you're in the 500s. But for a 5.7, that's a pretty good deal. Let me show you how it disassembles. Interesting concept. I've showed clear a, a whole bunch of times. But you're going to pull the trigger first. Take it back a little bit. Take these safety tabs. Or not safety. Take down levers. Correction there. Take down levers. And then just pull it off of the frame. And there's a look at the frame. Here we have a single captured recoil spring and the barrel in which the thread cap needs to be removed to take it out. But you get the idea. And here is the slide. All right. And then to put it back on, just get it into place here. That's not into place. Let me do it the right way. Like that. So it's into place like that and just charge it and it is back to its firing position. But I'm super excited about it, and when we talk about 5.7, here we've got Fiocchi Range Dynamics, Fiocchi High Performance, 35 grain, 62 grain, so a big difference here. Here we have Federal Target Loads, here we have some Self-Defense Loads by FN, and here we have AAC, so I have five different types of ammo that I'm going to test the 5.7 rock made by PSA. But it's a good looking handgun. Some people have said it fires great. Haven't done that yet. I've shot 
a lot of 5.7s in my life. I have not shot this gun yet, so I look forward to that. Should be very cool. I'm hoping it is. I've got five separate, separate types to run through it, but here it is. I took the bait. Now, you may be asking, well, what was the bait? What was the bait? The bait was this. This gentleman originally had this up for 240 bucks. I thought it was the Optics Ready model. And so I made contact, we, we talked about it, and then he said, you know, it's not the Optics Ready model. Because I said, do you have all the plates? Because I have some optics that I want to put on handguns. I've got more optics right now than I, than I know what to do with, honestly. And it's a good position to be in. But I wanted the optics ready. He said, it's not optics ready, but I really want to make this sale. I already purchased something else. I need to recapture that money. How about, and he took 60 bucks off, which made it under $200. So I figured for, for that price, I can't get hurt. I took the bait. Pretty happy with the bait that I took with night sights and 23 round mags and a little bit of ammo. So... I look forward to getting this to the range and running it through its paces and checking it out. I love the 5.7 because there's no recoil. It's super noisy, huge muzzle flash, but it, it's super fast and a ton of fun at the range. And I look forward to this 5.7 rock uh, range time with it and having a great time and taking you guys along for the ride. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.